What's up, guys? John back from Titan, and I'm here with my APRN, Cass Fernandez. So today we're going to cover some of the most common questions that I think Cass gets in his visits. Um, the first one I think is pretty common, right? And is basically, am I married to this therapy? Will I have to stay on this hormone replacement therapy or testosterone replacement therapy for the rest of my life? You're right. I get that quite often. Patients want to know, once I start this therapy, am I going to be on it forever? So the short answer to that is no, you're not. So when you come to us, we will evaluate your needs for hormones. Right. If you need a replacement type of therapy, we will prescribe one to you. However, our therapies are very therapeutic. So we're going to approach that in a way that doesn't shut your system down. Gotcha. So we're going to have gonadal support. We're going to be controlling your estrogen levels as well. So when it's time, if you decide after years of therapy and feeling mm -hmm. great, you want to come off, you can do that. And we'll safely do that with a tapering down approach. Gotcha. Okay. Now, with that being said, what we would do is we would lower those levels safely and you will revert back to what you were previously as your hormone levels. Now, mm -hmm. big disclaimer, as we age, our hormone levels begin to decline. Okay, right. so you may not be as high as you once were. However, you can safely come off of these therapies and have your production that you naturally have. Gotcha, gotcha. So that's a good point out there. So you guys ask that a lot. I wanna make sure the medical provider could properly explain it to you guys and, and it's it's really some good information you know people really don't know this information they think uh, once i go on this i'm gonna have to stay on this for the rest of my life i've seen this in some forums and online and stuff like that so it's awesome to explain it to people that sure. you don't have to be on this for the rest of your life let's say there's a health issue financial issue something goes on we can help properly get you off the exactly. healthy way um the second question is is you know Am I going to lose fertility or am I going to have a kid on testosterone hormone replacement therapy? Because we might get some, you know, people in their 30s and they still want to have kids um, or, you know, people in general are worried about fertility. What do you think? Sure. Absolutely. I mean, big question, important question. We all want to know that, especially as men, especially as men in relationships wanting mm -hmm. to conceive children one day. Right. So common misconception, you start hormones steroids, the negative things about them, abusing them. Yes, you can have some issues with them. However, again, our therapeutic approach with medical providers monitoring you closely, giving you gonadal support, yeah. keeping your function where right. it should be naturally is gonna help you potentially conceive children, right. okay? We have therapies, glutathione and HCG, human chorionic gonotropic hormones. Those can help you have strong, healthy sperm, healthy gonads. So definitely we are gonna take care of you as best we can to help you with all of your goals, even if it is conceiving children. Awesome, awesome. So I think that's another big one. Now, wh what do you think is the other big questions that you get? I mean, is there anything that sticks out in your head, you know, that you get a lot of questions, why commonly asked, asked question. I know, you know, uh, uh, needles, you know, does it have to be an injection? Can it be an oral form? Can it be a cream? Can it be a gel for uh, hormone replacement therapy? And, you know, and basically I think oh, yeah. that question is yes, right? I mean, I get, I could sit here all day and talk about all the questions I get, yeah. but that is an important one because patients want to know, is this injectable? Is this a cream? Is this a, a lotion? Right. Is this a pill? So right. we do offer all of those, of yep. course. Yep. Um, now they're indicated for different reasons, specifically per each patient. Yep. So I will say that obviously injections are where it's at. It's very precise the way to deliver that medication, yep. you know, in a manner that you absorb it well. Now for other patients, creams make more sense. Right. Um, and as far as pills go, you know, that is an option as well. Right. Um, but we will make sure we customize that approach for each patient, each one of you. Right. Yeah, because different people want different maybe administration forms, and we can definitely offer that for our patients to customize that regimen form. So it's great information there. The other thing is, uh, you know, the next thing I would think is, is, is testosterone going to make me aggressive or going to turn me into Arnold Schwarzenegger? Well, I mean, that'd be great, right, if we could all look like Arnold Schwarzenegger. Right. But the truth is, no, it's not going to turn you into a monster. Right. No, it's not going to make you super aggressive. Yeah. You now, that can happen with patients who are unbalanced, okay, right. without being treated by a medical provider. Yes. Hormones do change. They fluctuate. So when you change one, alter one, the other can have an effect. But, again, our therapeutic approach here at Titan, we're going to make sure that your levels are balanced so you have a positive reaction to the treatment and you feel well and optimized so it's all about balance so you're not mm -hmm. going to turn into you know an aggressive person that's mm -hmm. not what we do here at titan medical center mm -hmm. we're going to make you optimize we're going to help you with your health and overall wellness 
All right. So these are just a couple commonly asked questions by patients. Now, I think we're going to do some more content along the lines and sure. bring you some more questions and answers of these common questions that patients might want to know the answer to, just like you. So stay tuned. We're going to bring Cass back, APRN, or you might see him on your visit if you become a Titan Medical Center patient. So we appreciate you guys tuning in, and we'll see you guys soon. Guys, stay strong out there, stay healthy, and now let's stay educated, okay? okay.